Neutron scattering is an incredibly important technique in advancing materials research because they can travel inside materials without damaging them. Once inside, the neutrons reveal the material's internal structure at the atomic scale. This ability opens up a world of new possibilities for future technologies. And it all starts right here. The ion source contains specialized equipment that produces a negatively charged hydrogen ion. It's a hydrogen atom with two electrons. And in the front end, we produce a pea-sized bunch that we're going to use to accelerate down the rest of the LINAC. So the LINAC is a structure that's about three football fields long, and it contains two primary kinds of devices. Magnets that are used to keep this pea-sized beam bunched up so it doesn't blow up, and accelerating structures that give lots of electric kicks to this pea-sized bunch that accelerate it gradually to nearly 90% the speed of light by the time it hits the end of the LINAC. So when the ion bunch reaches the ring, it passes through a diamond foil that strips the electrons off of it and produces a proton. That's the first step. Now that we have protons, these protons circulate around the ring a thousand times, continually being added to by protons that are coming from the LINAC. Once the beam leaves the accumulator ring and goes to the mercury target, these energetic protons interact with the mercury nucleus and smash it to bits. And for each event, each one of these collisions, we get about 20 or 30 neutrons. And then we have these tubes that are aimed at the moderators. And these cold neutrons go down the tubes to these neutron scattering instruments and that's where the real neutron science occurs. 